Hi guys and welcome back. Today I have a Shein haul for you. This is the first time I purchased from Shein. So I'm going to share with you my thoughts. I'm going to be comparing like the pictures to what we really get. And I'll also show you how useful the stuff I got are. So, you know, um, sometimes when you go through websites like this, a lot of the things look so useful and so handy, but in reality, they wouldn't be so I'm not just going to show you what I got but I also want to show you if they are practical if they're easy to use and so yeah if you're interested then please keep on watching actually I was a bit surprised that it came in a bag like this I was expecting a box but it's okay right. so it's a bag in a bag and of course everything I show you I'll insert a picture so that you can see how it looks like on the website and how it looks like in real life so the first thing I got is this uh, measuring cup it also has measuring spoons inside I loved how it's all in one so it comes in pink and in blue I got the pink one um, it has measuring spoons and what's nice about it is all the spoons fit in the measuring cup so you have your measuring spoons as well as your measuring cup and it measures up to two cups next i picked up this um toothpaste and toothbrush holder uh let me see so it has I thought it's a suction cup it's not i think you peel this and there is a sticker and you stick it on the wall you put your toothpaste here and you can put your toothbrush on this side i'll actually stick this and show you if it's practical or not so there's that so next i got a frothing machine for milk but look how it arrived it's almost please don't misunderstand me i know that it's um like it was i think only three dollars but still um i don't like the quality at all it's very very like plasticky something i'm very excited about is this one actually this is okay all right not bad i was expecting this so let me show you this first so these, I got two different sizes of bags. I got these ones. Uh, they have white pocket dots on them, if you can see. And there's also a bigger size that looks like this. So this is how one looks like, but these particular ones already have the seal. So it's easy to put in your things and then just use the seal to close it but you know how sometimes certain bags don't have a self-sealing so you'll need something like this and that's why i got this and another nice thing about it is it has a magnet so i can just you know pop it on my fridge and whenever i need to seal something i'll just use this and of course i'll also try this and let you know what i think about it all my cleansers toners to just like put there i wanted something to put them all together organized in one place so i got this one and i noticed that they have two sizes so i got this one and i also got a size smaller so i'm assuming this one is a size smaller it's kind of tricky when it comes to sizes because they put a b c d on the image and you look at the image and choose which size you want as for quality it's not bad i mean yeah it's not bad at all i like it and i also like the copper color and this is a side by side comparison of the two sizes the big size and the small size next i got this um I actually don't know what to call it because once I open it, I'll show you what it is. So basically what it is, is you place this right under your sink. So let's say you're peeling potatoes, tomato, whatever you're doing in the kitchen and all that trash, you just, um, you know, like hang a bag here and all that trash can go there. I found it very useful for the kitchen. So I'll try to use it and let you know what I think about it. 
All right, so I wasn't sure which peeler to get, so I ended up getting two. So same thing, the plastic part is very, very plasticky. And the other peeler is this one. I kind of feel like this has a better quality. I don't know if you can see that. And on the other side, it has more of a zigzag shape. I'll give this one a try as well. Um, it's a, you know, a bit sturdier plastic than the other one. Other than that, I don't have much to say about it. I looked everywhere for these and I couldn't find, you know, when you're making cookies or even bread at home and you want to, you know, put on a coat of egg on top. So you need something like this, silicone-y. So again, they have these um, in four colors. I picked up the pink one. So not bad for the price. I mean, it is what I expected it to be. And this is how it looks like. Next, I saw this oil sprayer and it was really interesting because you know how sometimes you just want to lightly coat the pan with oil okay, so yeah this is how it looks like you can use this to spray oil on your salad if you don't want to put too much um, but i have no idea like how it will spray if you'll you know put out too much or too little again i'll try it for you and i'll let you know at the end of this video I have a plate that has parts, you know, just like the plates my kids use, but that plate of mine I've had for ages and ages because one of my very, very good friends had um, gotten that for me for Christmas. I, I didn't notice that the sides are this low, but other than that, the size is pretty good and it has three parts they had these in squares in circles but i saw that the rectangle is the most useful one next i got these paper bags and the reason i got these is very soon i'll start by the time you see this video i would have already started work again i'm a full-time teacher and sometimes i like to make my own sandwich or just you know bring along some croissants with me to school so i figured these bags would be you know really cute and nice to place the bread inside give it a fold maybe even you know staple it they are a bit bigger than what i expected or what i saw on the website but no other than that i like this purchase you know, i mean it's just paper bag it is what it is and yeah here i have another one of these toothpaste toothbrush holders so this one i got for my kids because it had like a you know animal drawing here so again you can put in stuff there you can hang the toothbrushes over here and i believe again this part is a sticker you peel it off and stick it on the wall i just saw that i i had forgotten actually that i ordered yet another one of these uh, but these ones are even smaller than the first two i showed you so if you compare the sizes this is next to that one it's a bit smaller a bit narrower than the other one this has small little flowers on it so lately i've been making a lot of homemade cookies so i grabbed these cutters so i will show you they have them in different designs again they put a b c d and you choose you go on the picture you choose which design you want and this is how they look like they're not just only for dough you can also use them to cut vegetables like carrots uh, because in the picture they show you that they've used them with veggies and they've used them with um dough as well like for cutting cookies i was hoping they would be a bit bigger than this they are too small i don't know i i think they're too small for cookies i think i grabbed these from either the toy section or the bathroom section i think bath toys or something like that um 
And the thing is you can't choose the color. They show you that there's blue and there's, you know, shades of blue and shades of pink and then you choose one. So I chose two different animals hoping that each one will come in a color because I have a boy and a girl. So I was hoping to have two different colors, but I got both of them in this color. I'm not mad. I love this color. There's a crab. Oh, this is so cute. So you put this in the bathtub and I believe it will be so much fun for the kids. I'm actually really excited to see how my kids are going to react to these. And the other one is a turtle. I forgot to show you this it was deep under all the mess I made while opening the other packages basically a set of three funnels there are silicone funnels that you can open up and use and I like that they fold so they won't really take a lot of space and I got it in pink, blue, and green. I think you never know what colors you're gonna get. So, yeah. All right, so this is how it looks like on the wall. I stuck it a bit low so that my kids can reach it easily. Uh, I put the toothpaste there. I hung the toothbrushes as well as their sponges. So yeah, overall, I am satisfied with this purchase. So this is how this one looks like. I popped it on the wall and you can put in, you know, your shower sponge or just anything you can put in your toothbrush here and the toothpaste there. So yeah, this is how it looks like. So just for size comparison, this is the smallest size I got, this is the medium size, and this is the big size. Of course they were not all together, it's not that I chose different sizes, um, but I'm just showing you so that you can have an idea how big each one is. I was thinking that this is something that goes over it no it's just a safety guard so when you're not using it you bring this here so that the metal pieces will not touch each other and it won't get hot so it's basically a safety guard and this part will just stay like that and you can use the magnet end to stick it on the fridge hold it together and all right so yeah see so not only it sealed it but it also cut it at the place where it's sealed but let's test it yeah it's sealed properly all right and i put this right under my sink you attach a back to it and all the waste can go there so now i'm going to try this one let's see oh actually i have milk in here lactose free milk and i put nescafe how your coffee is gonna look like I filled this one with oil and let's see how it works. Oh, okay. Not bad. I hope you enjoyed this video and found it useful. Please write in the comments below what else you want me to do a haul on and I will see you next time. Bye!